Hi, it's Tessa, and I just got back from Walmart, and I'm going to do a small grocery haul. Um, I am using my front-facing camera on my tablet, so if the quality isn't like 100%, that's because of that. But it's the easiest way for me to film in my kitchen real quick. So I'm just going to start with the first thing I bought, and I found these today. I don't know what they're going to be like, but it says, Food Should Taste Good, Oven Baked Crackers. These are roasted red pepper brown rice crackers and they're gluten free they have all natural gluten free kosher cholesterol free no MSG zero trans fat no artificial colors flavors or preservatives and 13 grams of whole grain so hopefully they're good they sound good on paper I also picked up the sea salt variety of those same thing um, hopefully they're good because I bought two boxes um, for a snack I love the Utz Honey Barbecue Potato Chips, and they are gluten-free. Um, you can have 20 chips, and it's only 14 carbohydrates and 9 grams of fat. No trans fat. So this is my one guilty pleasure. Um, then I picked up some hard salami. This is gluten-free. This is by the brand Danielle Inc., and it's... No MSGs and gluten-free. Remember, these are all from Walmart. For lunch meat, I also picked up Sara Lee lunch meat because it is gluten-free. And I got the roasted chicken breast and the maple honey ham. Um, this is to actually eat on a sandwich. This is um, for me to use to make a gluten-free pasta salad, which I've never made before. I'm going to show you what else I'm putting in there other than the ham. I am also making some, what do I want to say, potato salad. So I bought some russet potatoes, which i got to get those boiling. Frozen pineapple chunks, and I'm going to put these right in the freezer so they don't get soft. I bought some Hellman's Light Mayo, although I use Miracle Whip Light for my potato salad. I bought some of this original submarine dressing by Beano's. I think it's made in Pittsburgh, PA. Um, it looks really good. I have to shake it. I don't know what it's going to taste like, but I didn't see any gluten in the ingredients, so hopefully it's good. I bought the Ken's Steakhouse Country French Dressing for salads this week for work. Also gluten-free. Two little packets of the Bumblebee Premium Light Tuna in Water. These are great on a gluten-free roll-up or regular roll-up if you're able to eat that. I bought some plain rice cakes because I like to either make these into little mini pizzas. I just pop the toppings on, pop them in the microwave, and you have yourself a little pizza. Or just peanut butter and jelly or peanut butter and apple butter. You can do a lot with these, so I like those for my lunches. Now, these are my husband's foods because he doesn't have to eat gluten-free. So he got the Morning Start Original Chicken Patties which I can't eat. I'm going to put these right in the freezer now. So that's his. He also got two cereals. He gets the Great Grains Honey Oats and Seeds and Kicks, which I don't eat cereals, so I'm going to put them over in his section. The dog, for his breakfast snacks, gets the Lick and Crunch. These are um, vanilla cookies and peanut butter filled cookies with carob there's two different kinds in there. He likes those. Okay, last couple of things. For the salad, the uh, potato salad, I got a red onion. <clears throat> For the pasta salad, I got a trio of bell peppers and a thing of asparagus. I'm just going to steam these and cut them up and put them in the salad. For my lunch salads this week. I picked this up. This is called Green Leaf Triple Washed Garden Life Sweet and Crisp Lettuce. I never bought this brand before. It's grown in the USA. It's just like um, lettuce leaves. I'm going to try it and see how it is. And last, but certainly not least, I got some different eggs. These are Natural Harmony 18 to Farm Fresh Grade A Large Eggs. No added hormones, no antibiotics. So we shall see how those are. That is my grocery haul from Walmart. So I think we're set for the week. Now I got to get started on my salads and something in the crock pot for supper, which I don't know what that's going to be. 
Look at my necklace. It's falling down. All right. So that's everything. Thanks for watching, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.